tired of having your students create posters or PowerPoint presentations for their research projects? Well, if you answered yes to that question, I have found the perfect solution. Would you like your students to create a multimedia presentation? Glockster is an online platform for digital storytelling and interactive learning. It allows users to mix all kinds of media on one virtual canvas to create multimedia posters and access a library of engaging educational content created by students and educators worldwide. You're probably asking yourself, what is a glog? Take the G in graphic and add it to the log in blog, and you've got blog, short for graphical blog. A glog replaces the old-fashioned poster with an interactive multimedia image that lets the 21st century student interact with its content. With Glogster, students and educators create posters that integrates graphics, text, images, video, and sound. This lets students create and present their work across several mediums. To get started, you want to go to edu.glogster.com. Once you get to the website, you can go to Get Started. Here you can choose the account that fits you, a personal account, an educator account, or a student. If you already have a login, go to Login. This screen will bring you to your dashboard. Here you can see glogs that you've already started, and we're going to go to Create New Glog. This will bring you to all the different templates that are sorted into subject and categories. Once you find one that you like, click on Use Template. Once you have your template, you'll notice that you have a toolbar in this top left corner. This is where you're going to add text, graphics, images, change your wall, which is your background, add audio, add video, or data. I'm going to go ahead and start by adding and changing this text. You can double click on the text box. And here I'm going to type in George Washington. And I'm going to change the font size because I can see it's not going to fit. So I'm going to highlight it first, click on size, and then change it. Notice my toolbar is gone, but if you click the plus sign, you'll get it right back. Now I'm going to go ahead and add an image. I'm going to go to search images, and what's really nice about this, you have Google right at your fingertips. Once I find a picture that I like, I'm going to click on it. And you can also add a frame to your picture to make it fancy. Here you have all different categories of frames. I'm going to go ahead and choose the scroll. You can preview it right here. Click use it. Now you'll see the photo size is too large. So I'm going to grab one of the side arrows and pull it in. And I'm just going to move it to where I want it. Okay. Once I have the picture there, I can go ahead and if I want to start typing some facts, I can double click in this text box. I can get rid of that text and start typing some of my information. And then once I want to get out of the text box, I can just click anywhere on the wall. What's nice about Glockster is that you can also add YouTube videos instead of just having a boring poster of images and facts. I'm going to go back up to that plus sign and go to video. Here you have YouTube videos. You can just search for your topic. Once you see a video, you can click on it and preview it, just to make sure it's okay. Once you've previewed your video, you can go ahead and use it. Today we're going to Just going to close that out. 
Once you have your video, you can again click on it and shrink it to the correct size. And I'm going to go ahead and move this video over here. Once you have completed all your information, you're going to go up to the green save button. You can change the blog name. Then you can say if you're finished or unfinished, because you can always go back and edit your blog. And then it's all saved. Just to give you an example of what a finished blog looks like. This is one of my students' blogs on Theodore Roosevelt. Notice you can also click down and scroll down to see the rest of their work. Stop being boring and be a 21st century learner with Blogster.